This is the picturesque village of Roth unter Rietborg, near Edesheim, and home to 400-year-old grapevines. The grapes are ripe, and the pickers headed for the town's Rosengarten vineyard. One of the oldest vineyards in the world, it's 600 square meters in size, and has just three rows of vines. Wine grower Stefan Oberhofer invests a lot of time in the vineyard in an endless cycle of weeding, pruning and cutting. The hard work ensures that the 80 centimeter tall vines flourish for a few more years. It's difficult getting any kind of yield at all. Look at this little one. It's always exciting in the old vineyard. It's over 400 years old. Some of today's vines only last 20 or 25 years. And the fact that it's still standing is a small miracle. The 300 Tremina vines have been under a preservation order since 1968 and are believed to have been planted in the early 17th century. They've survived the ravages of the 30 years war as well as the grapevine louse probably thanks to their tough bark and roots. If you take a closer look, you can see that the stalk and bark have cracked open and it's hollow in the middle. It's amazing that it's still producing fruit. It's had moss for years and it's pretty gnarled and twisted. This picture shows how the vineyard might have looked in the early 19th century. The vines belonged to the Serre family for decades before they became the property of the Oberhofer estate in the early 1970s. It was bought by the current winemaker's father 40 years ago. In the early days, we used a horse for plowing and did the rest by hand. All the manual work means things are very labor intensive, but this venerable old fellow deserves it. This year's harvest is disappointing. It seems the cold, damp weather wasn't good for the old vines. But it's not the first time the vineyard has suffered a poor yield. The 2006 harvest produced just three buckets worth. The results for 2009 were reassuring, 400 litres. That won't be matched this year, but it's not looking too bad. So. But whether it's a bumper crop or a bust, Every year, Heidi Oberhofer holds a kind of Thanksgiving event. It's a tradition. The meal is intended to fortify the team before they get to work. The wine from the old aromatic Gewürztramina vines amounts to less than 1% of total production. It's a labor of love for Stefan Oberhofer. He's delighted with the 109 degrees reading on the Oechsler scale. That gives it Auslaser status, meaning excellent quality. All the promise of a classic vintage delivered in half-liter bottles. Connoisseurs say this Gewürztraminer has a more mature taste than others of its kind. Now all the Oberhofer family can do is wait and see what next year's harvest brings. <laughs> 